So you know, there's a, a, a fascinating ponim yofos in the end of Parshas Re'e that I saw that says on the pasuk v'loy yeiroa es pnei Hashem reikom. He says Amru Chazal chayiv adam lahakbil pnei Rabbi beregel. Okay, we know that. Yes, Loimar, the Romans at Torah, the Milas Espene Hashem says, The lawyer Espene Hashem Rekom, Kenya Shamru, Es Hashem, the Kehotiro, the Rabbis tell me the Hachom. Okay, now he says, Mihu Mashma, the Yoimo da Fayan Zion, the Davke Yoimaki Purim, Mitzvah the Hakbil Pne Rabbi. And this is a a very schwer array. There is a Gemara in Yoimo da Fayan Zion with days that says, that uh, somebody that's going lahakbil pnei rabboi oy mishe godel mimenu bechokma oy lahakbil pnei oviv is a lot of piss through um, a river and 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 his feet will get wet. Then the Gemara really says vaita that uh, so also the Gemara has an iboya if if the the Talmud is going if the Rav is going to the Talmud it doesn't seem bechlal that we're talking about the issue. Of Chayev Adam Lahakbil Pnei Rabbi Beregel. But even if we would be talking about this issue, I mean, it's definitely not a source that all the Anyam Kippur is a Chayev Lahakbil Pnei Rabbi Beregel. So I really don't know what he means to say. This is what he says. And he goes on to say, Yes, the Farish, Masha Kosov, in Malochim, Loy Hoydish Ayoim, Veloy Shabbos Ayoim, Mashma de Beshabbos, Vehoydish, Sorech Le Mezal. Yeah, that's if she would be going to the Novi for be Hoydish or Shabbos. The high Behoyde, the high Hoydish, Hainu Rosh Hashona, the Xiv Tikuba Hoydish Shoifer, the Shabbos Hainu Yemaki Purim, the Xiv Me Erev at Erev Tish Bissu Shabbatchem. Anyway, he's, he's, he's trying to say that only on Rosh Hashona and Yom Kippur is there. Which is definitely a, a, a Zvar Pella. But uh, I do want to explain maybe what the uh, idea behind this is. That it's not connected with the Gimel Regolim, but rather Rosh Hashanah and Yom Kippur are the times when one should be Magbil Pnei Rabbi. So, you know, we all know that our Yom Kippur is very different than the Yom Kippur in the time of the Beis Amigdish when people, I mean, the, the Yom Kippur was centered around the Avoidus Akorbonus, and the, the Mishnah says those who saw this didn't see that, those who saw that didn't see this, and uh, it was all it was all centered around the Avoidus Hayoim in the Beis Amigdish. So it was very different than the, our experience, but there's uh, something very surprising in the Mishnah in the end of Masech Tainis, where it says, Omar Rabbi Shimon ben Gamliel, There were no Yomim Toivim. You didn't have any Yomim Toivim that compared to Chamisha Osa Ba'ov and Yom HaKippurim. So the Benois Yisrael would dance in the vineyards. Bochur Sona Lift up your eyes. See what you're choosing. Don't go for beauty. And in other words, saying that Yom Kippur it's called Yom Chasunosa Izem Matan Torah because it's the day, as the Gemara explains, that we received the second Luchis. So it's Yom Chasunosa, and it's the time of Tzeena Ureena Benoist Tzion. And that's the Gemara brings as a source for this minute of Benoist Yisrael Yoytzeh Zvechoyles Bakrome. Now, Lachore, if Loi Hoyu Yomim Taivim Li Yisrael Kachamisha Sabaova Yom Kippurim, so these are the greatest Yomim Taivim. So we should add in the uh, quantity or quality of the simcha, the same type of simcha that we have in the Gimel Regolim. But why would we be doing something so different? I mean, what we're doing on Chamish Yosef Ba'ov and Yom Kippurim is something that we don't have any of it in the smaller, so to speak, Yomim Toivim. So where is this Bechal coming from? 
So it must be that this particular type of simcha is shaykh to the uh, is shaykh to these yomim tovim in particular, to these uh, dates. So bishloim chamisha sabaov. According to Rav Yehuda Marav, the Simcha on Chamisha Sabaov comes from the fact that it's the day that Hutru Shvatim Lovo Izebaze. So it has to do with Shvatim intermarrying. It has to do with marriage. So maybe that's why the way to celebrate is with the Bnei Yisrael Yoytzeis V'Choylois Bikram. But Yom Kippur, I mean, what is the fact that Yom Kippur is the day of Matan Lucha Shniz? How is that a reason for this Benais Yisrael Yoytis V'chaylis B'kromen? And look for Shidduch. L'chaira, we should say that it has to do with the fact that we're defining Yom HaKippurim as Yom Chasu Nosoi. But we find it difficult to understand what the connection is. Yom Chasu Nosoi in the context of Matan Luchish Nias is talking about a chasana between Klal Yisrael and the Rabbi Nishel uh, How does that connect with the uh, a marriage between uh, two yidin. So how how does that bring us to the Bokhur Sona Inecha or Ebimiyato Bokhir? There's another question, Lakhara, if if what we want is that the Bokhir should be Al Titain Einecha Binoi, Tain Einecha Bi Mishboche, so why do they have to go out into the vineyards and dance? I mean they could just hang up somewhere uh, a safer yuchsin. And everybody should check out the families in the book. I mean, why, 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 why would they have to be be So you know, during the aseres yomim shebein rosh hashanah liyom hakipurim, we are busy with the nase odom, which began on rosh hashanah, as we know. But the nase odom had two mahaduris. There was the madura kama which is the Odom Harishan Lifnei Achet. And there's the Madura Basha of the Odom Harishan Achrei Achet. Now, and then there's the Derech Hatikun, which is, which the Atem Kriyam Odom was tasked with from Matan Torah on. We became the Atem Kriyam Odom in charge of restoring uh, the, 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 the original Odom. And Yisrael Shomdu al Har Sinai Tosko Zuham Moson, which is we went back to the Madrega of Odom Arishan of Neachet. Then we again fell with the Chaito Egel. And then there was a Chidush of the Mahalach Hatikun, which began with Matan Luchishniz, and is something that's the long journey that goes on from Matan Luchishniz till Achris Ayomin that we're busy with correcting the Odom and 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 restoring the stature of the Odom that the that 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 he lost with the with, with the Chet Adas and once again with the Chet Ego. We know that ain't Puronus Haboal Yisrael. And by the way, it's Mavur in the Ran in 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 the Daftazai in Rosh Hashanah. Uh, this that Rosh Hashanah and Yom Kippur have to do with um, with the Chet Eitz Adas and the Chet HaEgel, which is these two uh, um, stages in the downfall of man. And this is the time during which we are Isaac in the Tikkun. Chazal say, Ein lecha puronus haboal Yisrael she'ein ba mi Chet HaEgel. That we're, we're, over the generations we're punished for the Chet HaEgel. Because all the Kilkulim, all the Averis come from that and they they are considered oichzin masse avoyseyan biyadeyan. In other words, it's 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 it all considered a hemshech to the chet ha'egel, and all the tikkunei tshuva are shayich to the chet ha'egel and back to the chet etzadas. So we have to go back to the original parsha of Brias Adam. In Parshas Bereishis it says vayitza Hashem alekim es Adam offer min haAdam avayipach ba'ap of nishma schayim vayi Adam lo nefesh chayo. And then Vayita Hashem Olekim Gan Boeden Vayosem Shomes Odom Asher Yotzar and Vayatzma Hashem Olekim Min Haadom Akol Eitz Nechmod Lamare B'Toiv Lamachol B'Toiv Hagan V'Eitz Adas Toivera. Then there's several psukim that describe the Gan in the Eden, 
And then it says, Vayikach Hashem Elohim Esa Odom, Vayenichayu Began Eden, Ovedo Le Shomro. Vayitzav Hashem Elohim, Al Ha'odom Leimu, Mikol Eitz Agan, Ochol Toichel. Umeitz Adas, Toi Vara, Lo Yisoichal Mimenu, Ki Vyoim, Achol Chom Mimenu, Mois Tomas. And immediately after that Pesach, it says, Vayoim Hashem Elohim, Lo Yitoi Vayo Yisa Odom Levadu, Esa Lo Yitza Kenegdu. And the Torah goes on, with several Pesukim, to describe the Seder Hayitzira of Chava. And then it says in the Seifa Inyan, Vayoim Ha'odam, Zoyis Ha'pam, Etzim Ha'atzoma, Yubosom Yipsori, L'Zoyis Yikore Isho, Ki Mi'ish Lukecho Zoyis, Alken Yazev Ish, Es Ove Ves Imoi, V'Dovak Bi'ishtoi, V'Hoi L'Boser. Now, the order of these Pesukim is very hard to understand, because if it's true that Lo Yitoiv Hayoyis Ha'odam Levadoi, and the the right way is that he should have an Ezek and Egdoi. So it was so already me Mi'ikara the Milsa. So even if we say that the woman needed to be created from Achas Mitzal Oisov of other Marishan, she need to, needed to be carved out of his body, and therefore she wasn't created independently together with other Marishan. Alkoponim, she should have been created from other. She would, should have been should have been carved out of other Marishan immediately after he was created. So what's the pshat that only after the tzivui of the mikol eitz hagan toy ochel toychel or meitz hagan meitz hadas toy vara loy soychel? Only after that it says loy vayom hashem alakim loy toy vayom hashem levadai and esel loy eitz kenegdoi. This should have happened before the tzivui of the eitz hadas. You know, Rashi says on the Pesach, Lo yitoi ve'yoyse odem levadoi, Zok Rashi, Shelo yoimru shtei reshu yoyishein. HaKadosh Baruch Hu yochid bo'el yoyinim ve'ein lo yizug, ve'ze yochid betachtoinim ve'ein lo yizug. So, according to the Pesach, the reason that uh, a man needs an Ezek and Egdo is like the Gemara says in Yivom, as Daf Samach Gimel, Ashkechei Rebi Yoysi le'eliyo, Ksiv Ese lo yezer, and Rabbi Yossi asked Eliyahu Anavi, "B'ma isha oizros elado? How is she a help? On my lay, Odo may be chitim. He brings chitim from the shuk, from the from the from the farm. The the chitim koyseis. Does he eat the chitim as is? Pishton, the chit pishton loyveish. But haloi nimtzeis meira einav umamidosay al radav. So the chera, this is the positive shot as the loyazer connects it. So, so we, we, the, the, that's why he needs the Ezek and So why does Rashi uh, dig up uh, this this uh, deep reason that it's because Shelo Yoyim Rushtei Rishu is saying Hu Yochid Bel Yoyim Vein Loizug Hu Yochid B'Tachtoinim Vein Loizug. But the pshat is because the pasuk doesn't say Loi Toiv Le Adam Hey Yoy Soi Levadoi. It doesn't say it's not good for man that he be alone. It says Loi Toiv Hey Yoy Soi Levadoi. Which means that it's objectively not good that man should be alone. It's not because of his needs. It's that's not good. And therefore, Rashi has to say that it's not because of his needs, it's because Ba'etzim, if man would be alone, then Yoim Rushtein. It's not because of his subjective needs. And that's Mukhach from the Gufa Indian, because Akadish Baruch could have created man in a way that he doesn't need an Aza Kenegdo. So it must be that be'etzem it's loy toy ve'yoy sa'adam levadoi. Adir Abba, because it's be'etzem loy toy ve'yoy sa'adam levadoi, therefore HaKadosh Baruch created man in a way that he should need an Eze Kenegdoi, and dafka she should be me'iro es einov umami dosoy al raglo. In other words, the loy toy ve'yoy sa'adam levadoi is not a consequence of the of 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 of, of man's needs. Adir Abba, man was created needy, that he should need an Ezek and Egdoi because Be'etzim, it's loy toiv hayoy sa'adam levadoi for his purpose in life. And therefore he was created in a way that he needs an Ezek and Egdoi. If a person would be created in a way that it's toiv loy levadoi and he doesn't need help, he would experience himself as a yochid betachtoinim. If he would be totally self-sufficient, he would become self-absorbed. And therefore he would be locked into his levad into his levadoi, and his 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 yechidus would not allow for him to connect with anything that's beyond himself. 
a person that's levadoi would not be open to the divine presence of the Yochid Ba'el Yoinim. And we see that the, the, the great downfall of man happened by separating from his Ezek and The Nochosh that was Oroi Mikol Chayas Hasoda, he's not Mafata them together, but Vayoymer El Ha'isha, the Gemara says in Shabbos, Kishabon Nochosh Al Chava Hitl Bazuamo. In other words, he 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 separated Chava from Odom. Nochosh, the Gemara the Rashi says, Hanochosh Hishiani, Hisiani, Loshin Esuin. So only by separating the ish from the isha, the isha from the ish, was was it possible for the eitzah of the nochash to be miskabel? And Rashi says on kan kofar which means he was koifer in the toive. The truth is loy toive saw them levadoi. And the Ezek and is what brings him to Toiv. And he was Koifer B'Toiv, meaning he was claiming to be self-sufficient. He could do it on his own. And that's the Kan Koifer B'Toiv. So it's really only man's neediness to be completed from the outside that opens him to what's beyond himself. And only when a person is conscious of the Loi Toiv in the Levadoi, when he doesn't experience himself like the Yochid B'tachtoinim, he could connect with the Yochid B'el Yoinim. The Dovak B'ishtoi is a very strong term. I mean, it's it's used uh, rarely, <clears throat> usually in the context of Dveikos, is usually used in the context of Dveikos to the Rabbi Nishalel. Even though by Rus it says, V'rus Dov Kabo, that Dveikos really was part of the Ameich Ami, V'eloi Kayech Eloi Koi, so from the fact that the Torah uh, defines the connection between Ish ve'ishtoi as dveikus, it would seem that dveikus be'ishtoi is really a, a mavoi, is a way to reach dveikus ba'ashem. When a person goes out of his bubble as a yochid b'tachtoinim and he's dovok in something that's beyond the ani va'afsi oid, he could come to a matzav of atem adveikim ba'ashem aloykeichem ta'im kul chamayoyim. And therefore, only if the man was given a mitzvah through which he has the 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 possibility to connect with the Rabbi Shalom. Mitzvah is Miloshan Tzavsa, Miloshan of a connection between the Mitzvah and the Mitzvah. So he the, there was a need to to give him a, a a window, to give him a door that he should be able to exit himself, to exit his Levadoi. And therefore, if to the Vayetzav Hashem Alekim Adam Leymar, which Chazal say were well, all the Zion mitzvahs bnei noyach, so he has he has a, a, a way to connect with the Rebbeinu Shalom, but he has to have a door to to, to get out of his levadoi. So loy toy ve yoy saw the levadoi yes loy yezik connectoi, so that he should be able to go out of his levadoi ness, and so he'll be zayche to ish ve isha shchina shruya beinehem. The dveikus beinehem will enable. The, the 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 divine presence in their life. Vahavto lereyacha kamoicha ani Hashem is that ava to the reya exposes a person to the ani Hashem. That's why it's a klal gadol b'torah. And you know, I've said it many times. The chinuch says in the mitzvah of Lamed Gimel kibud aveim misharoshi mitzvah zoy sheroi loy lo adam sheyakir v'yigmal chesed lemisha asa imaytoy. Ulmanakeru <laughs> And he goes on and on and on and on. So the since the chiyuv of Akaras Atayv towards the Rebbeinu Shalom is kama v'chama, many times more than his chiyuv towards his parents, as a kolshkin, as a kal v'chayma, as he's saying. So why does he have to begin with a kal? Why does a person have to first exercise Akaras Atayv? Practice Akaras Atoiv with his parents, which is the Kal, and only Mitoich Kach Yale, 
lahakir toy vasokel. So it must be that since we're human, so we don't really relate to uh, abstract concepts. And therefore, the kvoya mida benafshoi, he can only by having a korosatoyv to a human being that's, 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 um, there's somebody that's tangible and real. And only if the, one practices a chorus to some to somebody that's real and, and present in, 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 in the simple sense, only then me toich kach yale to be makir the toivas hakel. And therefore is the is the is the way to come to Ani Hashem. And therefore, kol kula, which 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 demands of us to 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 exit ourselves, it depends on vahafter yachak kamoicha. And therefore, a shori b'lo yisho, with whom he's mekayim boy from kavua vahafter yachak kamoicha, a shori b'lo yitorin. So you know, shebo nochash al chavo hitul bazuhamo. That's the zuhamo of pirud between ish v'ishtoi, the zuhamo of the illusion of levadoi, the zuhamo of yochid betachtoinim. Yisrael shom do al har Sinai paska zu amosa because vayichan shom Yisrael neged ahar ki ish echad beleiv echad so they exited the zuhama of levadoi through the kolonu keechad we were zoyche to barchenu avinu and then baor panecho nasat alonu toras chayim but soon there was a kol mochama b'machene. And it be, and 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 it, it it becomes clear that they 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 prefer an abstract eagle over the face of Ze Moshe Ha'ish. They they choose Dafka Mikola Behemo the Oifa Shemaim the Chol Chayes Asode, in in whom man did not find an Ezek Kenegdoi, and they don't challenge his Lavadoi, the Chayes and the Behemis. Dafka from there. They want to get the Yel Chulifonenu. That's the Chazro Zuha Mosom. On the Posik, Laha, Lahavos Hashem Eloi Kechol Shmoya Bekoilo Uledov Koboy. The Gemara says in Ksubis, Nafkof Yudalov, Vichi Efshe Lodom, Lihi Doveg Beshine, Elokol Hamesi Bitoil Talmud Chochen, Boise Prakmatia Letamid Chachomim in a Chosov, Malo of a Kosov Kilum is Dabig Beshine. So the dveikus and shechina is only possible through dveikus in a tangible, real Talmud Chochem. Because Dafke, the real Talmud Chochem, who, with whom I can have kina, sinna, tacharus, that brings me out of the limits of my selfish self in which, um, in which I am. And it enables me to touch on something that's beyond myself. Dafke through Moshe Ish, they were zoichet to be aminu ba Hashem u b'Moshe Avdoi. As the Chinuch says, "Kishiyik ve'al zois amida benafshoi yala mi menol haki." And therefore, it's only through the Kish Echad Beleiv Echad that we were zoichet to ato reisel adas ki Hashem u lo kimei noigel vadoi. And so also the Doris, all the Giluim and the Hasogis of Yom Chasu Nosoi. Are dependent on the fact that the Yom Chasunosli, which is the Yom Matan Torah, the Yom Matan Luchashnias, is, as we say in the Musaf of Yom Kippur, is a Yom Simas Ahavo Vereus, Yom Azivas Kino Vetacharos. So before Matan Torah, we were told, Al Tikshu Elisha, because in order that the connection be, between Ish the Ishta should be freed of its Achar Hachet Tzura. There has to be a al tikshu, and only after shuvu lochem ohalechem, which is an oil of zochu shchina shruya beinayim, and so also on the yom slicho mechila liyisrael, which is the day shenitnu boy luchas achroinus, we are meant to restore the tzuras adam vayikra lahem adam, and to be mafkia the tronye of aisha shenasato imadi hinasnali. So on this day. We're, we're called on to be Megala, that Dafke the Chibur to the Kenegdoi, that's the Ezer, because the Chibur to the Kenegdoi brings my, me out of my selfish self, and it makes me Ois Yochid B'Tachtoinim, and so I can become aware of the presence of the Yochid Be'al Yoinim. Yes, yeah, so on Yom Kippur, we're busy with 
ridding ourselves of the Nochash HaKadmoini that contaminates the Vedovak. So on this day, the Bnei Yisrael, Ayoytes V'choyles B'kromim, and they say, Bochur Sona Einecho Re'ei Ma'ata Borelok. This day is about restoring the Koyma Sa'odom, which is which is dependent on the Tikkun of the Alkain Yazoiv Ishes Ovives Imoi Vedovak Be'ishtoi. And the Tikkun is in this world, Dafka, where there's a Breire, and there's a Bechire, Bemi Ato Boiche. There's a possibility of Nesines Einayim Benoi. And nevertheless, the Bocher HaBocher is Mekayim the Sona Einecho. He lifts his eyes above the Noi, and he's Nois and Einov B'mishpoche. Yom HaKippurim, we, 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 we were elevated to a Madrege of Malachi Ashores. So Dafke, on this day, there's a need to emphasize the, that, that you can't start from on top. And as the Lashon of Chazal V'chi, Efshili, Davik B'shchinah, Sometimes, you know, people think it's easier to be David B'Shechina than to be David in a Talmud Kochem, because the Shechina is an abstract concept. It doesn't, it doesn't threaten me. It doesn't, it doesn't challenge me. But to be David in a Talmud Kochem is much harder. But the Dveikus that doesn't come through Dveikus in a Talmud Kochem can be an illusion. And it's Dafke, V'chi Efshali David B'Shechina. How? Only through Dveikus in a Talmud Kochem can somebody be David B'Shechina. And 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 al derech zeh through the vahavtor yachok kamoicha can somebody be zoyche to connect to Ani Hashem? You know vahavtor yachok kamoicha. People find it easier to love a Jew on the other end of the globe that I never met and I never saw and I never heard of because I'm falling in love with the concept of a Jew. But it, it, falling in love with the reality of a Jew is much harder, especially if you know him. So 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 the pshat is that that but that's really where where one grows only by 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 uh, being challenged and and overcoming those challenges. So so uh, I'm just saying it could be that this the idea behind the punim yofis that that says that the mitzvah of lahagbuk nei rabbi beregel is only on Rosh and Yom Kippur has to do with this idea that Rosh Hashanah and Yom Kippur is a tikkun for the chet haegel. Where the pgam was then moishoi I say lono elohim ashiyelcho lefanenu. They wanted an egel azov, and we say name dafke on yom kippur chayv on lahagbuk nei rabbi beregel v'chiyev shelo davik b'shchina. It's dafke through the moishoi. It's dafke through the rabbi that's uh, that's 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 down here. So on the yon chasun nosoi, which is between Hakadosh Baruch Hu and and Klal Yisrael. The Yon Chasun Nosei really depends on the Bochur Sona Inech Orei B'Mata Boyeloch. In other words, the Mahalach HaTikun for the V'chi Tava Hu Le'inayim that was Choyze Venir by the Chet Egel and brought to the V'ashabrim Le'einechem is al, is through the So No Einecho Urei. So on this day, which is a Yom Simas Ava Vereus, Yom Azivas Kina V'Tachrus, uh, our avoid is to a little bit get out of our shell. And 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 feel other people and care for other people, and and uh, and be mekayim the seu moroin einechem uruumi bara ela. And the Eibes is all we should be zoyche. We should be zoyche to a gmar chasim and uh, we should be zoyche to 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 do tshuva, to do tshuva. Uh, that's really the mitzvah sayoyim, as you know. Uh, the Rabbein Yoyinus says that is a. Uh, uh, a mitzvah to do tshuva on Yom Kippur. The Rambam says the kates mechilu slichel Yisrael. In any case, I wish you all a guten yomtiv 